at exactly 48 degrees 52.6 minutes south latitude and 123 degrees 23.6 minutes west longitude at 2.5 miles or 4 kilometers beneath the surface of the ocean rest the remains of over 260 spacecraft. This location is known as the Spacecraft Cemetery. This spot, sometimes referred to as Point Nemo in the middle of the Pacific, is the most remote location on Earth, positioned 1,450 nautical miles away from any blip of land. This remote location makes it perfect for crashing giant spacecraft into the ocean. Space agencies all over the world use this location as a safe dumping ground for retired or broken satellites orbiting Earth. Leaving these satellites in orbit would contribute to the growing problem of space junk, so they use the small amount of fuel left on the craft to direct them into this precise spot in the ocean. Only large craft make it to the spot. Smaller satellites in spacecraft burn up completely upon re-entry. For the larger craft that do make it to splashdown at Point Nemo, their parts break up and scatter over a seafloor area of over 6.6 .6 million square miles. Between 1971 and 2016, this location became the final resting point for 260 craft, with more coming in the near future. Notable craft buried here are the Soviet-era Mir space station, 140 Russian resupply vehicles, several of the ESA's cargo ships, and as of recent, a SpaceX rocket. Joining these spacecraft skeletons of past will soon be the International Space Station. NASA plans on crashing the laboratory into the cemetery location sometime between 2020 and 2030. While it may seem odd to just discard all of this expensive space equipment to an unreachable point in the ocean, it's actually the safest and most economical disposal technique. If agencies were to leave the spacecraft debris orbiting Earth, it could crash into other functioning satellites or crash into other populated areas here on Earth. In most cases, there's really only two options when looking to retire a spacecraft crash it into the Earth, or propel it out of orbit. For larger craft, usually the safest bet is a controlled crash into the space cemetery. Space research isn't always profitable or even beneficial, but it does result in some interesting discoveries and peculiar side effects, like there being over 200 retired spacecraft in the middle of the Pacific Ocean, two miles below the water, buried for the rest of eternity. Thanks for watching! If you enjoyed this video, you can check out more of our content here, here, and here, and be sure to stay tuned for our regular content every Monday or our new series, Friday Facts, which comes out every Friday. Thanks for watching!